Hey, everybody. So we have two old WGs, old white guys, shooting. Beware the angry white man, white man, white man. Beware the angry white man. Please have your gun in hand. He'll come for you. You don't even know this fool. Go upside your head. Lay down. Play dead. Beware the angry white man. Dun, 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 dun. Please have your loaded gun in hand. So he saw the black teen at the door who just rang the doorbell, a small child. He was in no threat. My opinion, he probably looked through that doorbell, saw who he was, and I kid you not, a lot of times people get older, especially if they're evil and bitter, is how I view these two men. They'll do the unthinkable. Oh, I'm old. I don't get away with it. I hope he doesn't see the light of day. He was in no threat. That there was no threat made here. The DA already said it was a racial component. There was absolutely no threat, none whatsoever. Shot him in the head and in the arm. And then the kid runs to the neighbors, doesn't get any help, not wants to get involved. Again, he people are doing what they want to do. And in this case here, I think he just wants to shoot somebody. Oh, I'm gonna say that I was scared. You were in no danger. He shot through the glass door. Why? Doing what he wants to do. They should let him out. I hope he spends his last days in that prison system. And you won't have your gun then, Popsy. You won't have your gun then. You think this eye looking crazy. Stick around in, in, in population. Wow. Just absolutely, just horrible. 84 years old. And then it makes me wonder, when people do things like this, when people do things like this, it makes me wonder, have they done this before and just got away with it? Maybe they've done this before and just to get caught. Because I don't see how you're a normal person and just go and do that. Look at him. I hope they give him 100 years. 2025. 20, That'll pretty much be life giving him his age. But people are doing what they want to do. People are doing what they want to do. And he made that decision. Again, a racial component to it, you think? I think he saw a black teen and decided, oh, I'm going to oh, shoot, shoot. And he did. Twice. Again, there was no threat of danger to him. He was in his home. The kids on outside the door. All you have to do is say wrong address or go away. I'm calling the police. No, 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 no. Old Popsy had that gun out ready, obviously, and shot that kid. If he didn't have it ready, he must have went and got it. Then we have this fool right here, 65 years old. This one's name is Kevin Monahan in a rural area. It must be booming through the baby. The girls were in the driveway in a rural area. And he shot. Other reports say, I mean, he shot in the, uh, as they were in the car. They didn't even get, this girl didn't even get out. No one got out. They simply pulled in the driveway. And they, other reports I've seen, he shot in the car. She got hit and she died. What did she do? They put up in the driveway to turn around. So how was that 65-year-old white guy, how was he in any danger? Girls in a vehicle. How was he in any danger? I sure don't see it. Maybe, as I often say, people are just doing what they want to do. Now, I had this jingle here for the guy that did the shooting at the bank, but uh, it'll be applicable here to these uh, two old geezers. At this point, they shouldn't be let out. And a lot of times people are relying on their age. Oh, I can do this. I'm old. It's like that old man that they had uh, a march and he just ran his car through the crowd, killed one girl. It's happened before. They had an old man up, up north, ran with a lot of people. And as he was driving, people were yelling, pounding on his car to stop. Old fool was still driving. Why? Wow, he's evil. He's doing what he want to do. And sometimes when they're older, they think, oh, I can do it and I'm going to get away with it. 
Like meanwhile, when they had that death between she and her husband, he got the grim news. And I said, oh, maybe she thought, yo, your time is up, not mine. And I think she helped him die or something because he didn't want to live like that. So he died and she was supposed to go ahead and do her part to go with him. She had second thoughts. Maybe she wanted to have one more geriatric hot girl summer. She probably thinking, yo, you're, that's, they really punched your ticket, not mine. So she helped her husband die. And then I was thinking she would go home too. No, they tried to hold her without bail. So much for the, I guess they pretty much ruined any possibility of her having a geriatric hot girl summer. But see, people are doing what they want to do. These young people, nobody should have been shot. Nobody was in danger. Since when is ringing a doorbell in danger? So beware the angry white man, beware the angry black man, beware the angry person. Anger is one letter away from danger. And you can see why. Nobody was threatened. She didn't threaten anybody. The other kid ringing the doorbell, he didn't threaten anybody. He rang the doorbell and ends up here. Oh, cannot imagine. Why? People are doing what they want to do. People are doing what they want to do. They want to act out and they're doing it. The, these two fools, old geriatric fools, decide to go ahead and shoot these young people. He's very small. Oh my goodness. I cannot imagine for the parent. He rang the doorbell. I'm assuming to get these two. And how do you get shot in the head? It's a wonder he still survived. It's the one he can even go for help. There's a lot of angry people, man, just waiting, wait, wanting to do something. And that's why I always say people doing what they want to do. Very sad, very shocking. So he survived. I'm just wondering, you know, oh. You know, just turn your life upside down. Beware of geriatric dust among us. And I do think a lot of people, they they pretty much think they can get away with it because of their age. But both of them, they're not fit to be released into society. They should be locked up. So I'm going to go ahead. This jingle here was for another video. But uh, let's see. What a geriatric thing. At? What, what, where is it? Ah, look, look at him. Oh, gosh. Oh my gosh. Him coming to the door with that face. Whoo, that's terrifying enough. 84 years old. He deserves no sympathy, no none whatsoever. And neither does that 65 year old because the girls just pulled up into the driveway and you start shooting. Again, you're not in any danger. Didn't even get out of the car. Kid ringing the doorbell. All you have to say is go away, wrong address. What do you want? No, this old piece of crap want to shoot somebody. I hope he enjoys the extended stay, a.k.a. jail. I hope he goes to prison, at least for 30 years. Since you want to be the tough guy. They're going to watch. They're going to work with the other good eye you got. Anyway, let's go ahead. I'm going to go ahead. Let me know what you all think. It doesn't make any sense. People are acting out again. They are what doing what they want to do, good or bad, right or wrong, all day long. People are doing what they want to do. So be careful in your travels. We're gonna end on this note with this jingle. I'm sure I remember this song called Move, Get Out the Way. Okay, so in this case, here I know a lot of these stories are, are hard, you know, um, uh, sad. I know. But we have to be aware. This is the society that we live in. This is where we are. You can ring a doorbell and get shot. You can pull. Who has them pull into a driveway and back out? Why? The dusty, the dangerous dusties among us. They come in all nations. Now there's a whole lot of white ones, whole lot of black ones, Hispanic, Asian. And you got a whole lot of young ones and a whole lot of old ones. What's the saying I heard the lady say? A young fool is the good makings of for an old fool. And I was like, what? A young fool, unless they change, going to grow up, 
be an old fool. A person that's young and violent, grow up and be an old violent person. Hence what I think about this trash on the screen. I don't care about him being 84. He should be in there for the next 30 years. The 65-year-old year dude, he should be in there for the next 40 years. Somebody pulled up into the driveway. Somebody rang the doorbell and uh, shots ring out. No, I see these as two evil beings. So, in closing, here is another dusty jingle that we can add to the channel. Okay? Y'all know it's homemade. I don't have no keyboard up in here now. So, yeah. So, in closing, all I got to say, listen, people. Be careful, be alert, be aware. There's too many dust buckets out there. They're coming all colors, all nationalities, north, south, east, and west. International dust, what we're dealing with, okay? And they also come in all ages. Here's one. Where's the other fool that I, I consider him a fool? You didn't have to shoot that, shoot in that car, and now that girl is dead. Kevin Monaghan. Boy, I hope they put him in that cell and let Chubby Cheeks loose the way he needs to be in there for 30 years. B both of them they should not come out this is a young a young child there, there was no threat the young girl in the vehicle there was no threat of small statue people know what they want to do they want to shoot okay let's go ahead and get to the dusty jingle let me know your thoughts feel free to comment like dislike subscribe share again be alert be aware there's too much dust out there okay it really is too much dust this way billy move chick get out the way say why billy got mad today come on move chick get out the way what is he doing billy got mad today you better run move chick he's gotta get out the way oh my gosh billy's gotta go today you better run you better run he's got a gun you better run